Take it to my heart. Hey guys, Austin here, and welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft Let's Play. I am recording this at night time, so I will have to be a little bit quiet. Just a little. Just a little. But either way, guys, I am going to be making this episode for you guys out there enjoying life. So, what am I going to be doing today? First off, I'm going to show you some tools I have gotten. So, I think it was today, this morning, I believe. I got this amazing pickaxe. Oh boy, we finally got the fortune and I believe after school, uh, right before I left for the basketball game, I got a silk touch. So now I can just use this up, finish it off, and we got the ultimate tools. So we got silky touch, we got the billionaire's fortune, I made a diamond axe just because it didn't have unbreaking so it's not the ultimate axe, and then the level 30 my butt sword, knocked back two for level 30 crap my butt and then my bow the cat niz I just don't have the levels for that so yeah I do apologize I am gonna be very quiet this episode I'll have to turn up my volume quite a bit in the um, render process so it's not so quiet but I was planning to actually um, build the bridge this episode but I'm not sure I'm ready for that and it's gonna take too much time so I decided I'm going to actually get to work on making a storage room, or at least setting up an easy simple one. But to get started, we're going to mine all the diamonds I have so far. So, I was able to get a diamond block from just mining randomly, and this is the original 36 that you guys saw. So, let's see how many diamonds we can actually get. I'm going to try not to pick any up. Oh boy. Normally it's 36, how much can we actually get? If we got level 30 from this too, that would be amazing. Okay, we have, we have one diamond. Oh man, this is gonna be quite the experience. Do I have a stack? Did I reach a stack? Whew. Oh my goodness, look at all those diamonds. Oh boy. Thank you so much, Fortune. You're amazing. You are completely amazing. So yeah, we have tons of diamonds now, which equal how many diamond blocks? Gonna find out real quickly. We got 10 diamond blocks now. That is awesome. Let's throw you guys in there. And let's go mine some wood. This is the reason I made this ax, so I could go chop down some wood real quick. I don't want you. Oop, didn't mean to do that. Okay, there we go. And I have not made the tree farm yet. It's just a simple little tree farm here, and we're just we can live with it for now. So yeah. Um I believe I actually have a question of the day, so let's check that real quickly here. Did I have a question of the day? Yes I do. Okay, so question of the day. What mobs I spawn? boss do you find most annoying by Chad Kelly once again great to see someone who actually likes to give me questions of the day quite quite a lot so thank you so much for all your questions as always leave your question of the day in the description below so yeah um what mob or thing do I find most annoying? That is quite the hard question. Now, I can't officially say I've ever really faced the Wither yet. This will uh, hopefully be the first series and first time I ever faced the Wither. As you guys might have known from my last Let's Play, that was the first time I actually ever legitly defeated the Ender Dragon. Normally I do it in creative, so that was quite the achievement for me. I was really happy about it. Let's chop down one more tree. Perfect, 64, that's what I wanted, okay. So let's grab some saplings and replace these trees because I think that is quite green and smart. But I can't say the wither, but oh, I don't really, I'm not gonna count bosses because there's reasons they're bosses, so. Yeah, no bosses counting, we are only gonna do mobs. Now, I want to say the skeleton. Um, I'm not going to. But I would, I would probably say second would be the skeleton, and um, 
third would have to okay so we're gonna do a countdown from the top five most annoying mobs in minecraft in my opinion so number five will be the let's see number five will be the cow because they are obnoxiously annoying <laughs> That was a complete joke, but whatever. Number four would be... Hmm. I have to say the spider. Um, because it is quite obnoxious on servers because it's leap. Plus lag is just unbelievably impossible to fight against. Um, number three would be zombies. Now number three and two is going to be based more on ultra hardcore as compared to survival but they're also very annoying survival zombies are annoying in both because hitting them you spawn more zombies and it is obnoxious it's annoying it's really stupid i hate zombies all together but they're easy to kill so that's the only part that i don't have problems with ultra hardcore there's lag and zombies can completely demolish you with heart so i also moved the sugarcane farm over there for now and second is going to be of course the skeleton because the skeleton is possibly one of the most annoying nut mobs in all the universe i hate skeletons so much it's just unbelievable they're so freaking annoying i just i can't stand them i'm actually going to start keeping a lot of food on my bar from now on i've decided that so just letting you guys know so now we have some chests and let's go down. So the number one most annoying mob, now at least, I'm not counting the nether or anything like that, would be have to be the the witch. The witch is impossible. If you're in a cave, no matter how much freaking armor you have, I don't care. A witch gets you in poison and there's water trapping you. You are screwed, mister. I mean, the witch is faster. He'll hit you with just he, she, whatever. It will hit you with its slowness. Hit you with the crazy one minute poison. Will hit you with instant damage. Oh my gosh, I hate witches. You will die. So, witches are the most, in my opinion, the most annoying mob in the game right now. Since they naturally spawn now dumb decision in my opinion but yeah they're very annoying i mean with this katniss bow i have here they don't stand a chance but to the mo for the most part they are impossibly annoying and i would rather not have to deal with them so should i leave this i think i'll just leave it in here just because oh, i'm just like did i even grab the chest like what am i what am i doing here okay so let's add a few more chests. Let's just make all of these chests. Like, why not? We need chests. We need chests galore. So we're going to make chests galore, basically. Let's mine you out one more. We actually need more torches. I never didn't really think about not having torches. So I'm realizing I am really quiet. This is going to be interesting to see how loud I actually have to make this. Hopefully you guys can deal with it. Um, I need to really stop procrastinating to the night time to record but um that's what happens when you have basketball games it's just but gotta watch youtube videos and the next thing you know oh my goodness it's so late and i still need to record but i can record tomorrow but then i can't get onto the schedule i'm trying to oh, that's what i that's what i think so that's the story of my life how about you Okay, so let's hop back down here. Hopefully no mobs have spawned. Level 30 my butt will protect us. I seriously cannot. I have the worst, seriously the worst luck with picks. I mean, oh my goodness, it's so bad. Okay, so how are we going to do this? I think, so how many chests do we have? We have eight chests. So I think we will go ahead and grab ourselves eight leather. Since we actually have plenty of leather, surprisingly, because I actually kill cows in this. I actually think this might end up being perfect. Yes, it will. Got all the item frames in the world. 
and that's all we actually need because this is what will organize all our stuff so boom 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 this is just temporary we just need something something to do something so this is what this is for and yeah so let's go up here and let's figure out what we're gonna start with so I would love to have an emerald but I guess I don't so we'll just go with an iron ingot I guess so we have the ore chest um, cobblestone chest the, the crap chests are in the um, the mine shaft so I don't have to worry about that chest we will have the food chest we will have the plant chest and the what else do we need I might actually be able to have a cobblestone chest I think I will we'll go with the cobblestone chest, a dirt chest, a stone chest um, a mob drop chest how many does that cover up? I believe it's seven yes yeah, seven so what is gonna be the last thing so I think ores should be the first then we'll go food mob drop plants the stupid coal and um, and dirt and stone and the last thing will be wood there we go that's that's what we, we need wood I actually have wood so there we go hopefully that will cover about everything I think it should not completely and utterly sure but we can start placing stuff away in here like so thank you very much okay so let's go grab all, all our stuff slowly put it down and that is what we're gonna do for this episode uh, might as well because it's not anything exciting as you can tell because my voice is very low I do not know where I'm gonna put gravel I was thinking about making a chest for gravel but I chose not to so interesting we still need to make Joey a house that that's what we're gonna do we're gonna write in the book of amazingness seven Joey's house there we go one day I'm going to sign that I can tell you that right now it's gonna happen it'll have to happen it's just it just makes sense that it will eventually happen okay so let's hop back up here real quickly and let's grab the rest of the cobblestone we actually have a few things that will stay up here oh, I'm just gonna get rid of most of the stuff so yeah that's gonna be the plan that would be the plan so that's all the cobblestone very nice very nice um that's what we we want to get all the cobble oh oh that's that's different i didn't know it did that okay so now we'll go for dirt and stone i don't know if i have enough dirt to cover my whole inventory straight away and if i don't then i'll just grab the stone i know i have a lot of stone here but i believe that's going to be for the bridge not completely sure yet how I'm gonna build the bridge so oh I left all this cobble whoops the daisies um yeah I guess we're not done yet my bad my bad so this is actually really just a wasted chest because I do have chests down there just for cobble but oh well it it can happen it can go how it goes so obviously I'm gonna have to put some of this cobble, actually I can grab the dirt now too. So I don't believe I have too much dirt, I could be completely wrong. Um, yeah, I'm not, I don't have a lot of dirt. Uh, I have, I definitely have the ability to get a lot of dirt if I want to because of my super OP shovel we have. Okay, so that's full, it is full, right? Yeah. Okay, so we'll go down here real quickly. And throw the rest of the rest of the cobblestone into the crap chests, and um, yeah, these are basically just so whenever I finish a strip mine, 
can just chuck the cobble in there and continue, basically. So I do plan to make rail tracks and stuff. There's a lot I have to plan to do, but for now, we're just trying to get stuff done. I also want to ask you guys a question. What would you, how do you want me to stay in the 1.7 release with Optifine? Or would you like me to go to, um, what is it? Would you like me to go to, on the snap, the 1.8 snapshots? I will let you guys choose that, but I'm just wondering because basically the tools I'm making are going to be almost impossible for me to repair just because they're going to be such a pain in the butt. Um, it's it's gonna be really bad if you if I do have to say so myself because they're gonna be so expensive and stuff so I just wanted to bring that to you guys oh man I'm getting like some acid reflex not too happy about that um, I'm just organizing how this how it goes I don't even know don't even know what I'm doing so next is gonna be food items I believe I can count wheat for that maybe maybe I still have these dumb items here that I should use up but whatever okay so I'll count that as food just because it can I can um, pumpkin could be made but I think I'll keep that as a plant that's food that would be food this is food um, I'm sure I'm gonna end up missing stuff because I don't have the best eyes, especially at nighttime. But you know that's how it works and stuff like that. Mushrooms are plants, and got more apples here. Got enough gold to easily make two OP golden apples if I ever want to. I don't think I will, but for the most part, yeah. Wow, uh, this this video. Man, I'm gonna be like, wow, I sound like I'm just exhausted. Because <laughs> I have to be so quiet. I don't want my parents coming in and yelling at me for being loud and obnoxious and things like that. I'm sure you guys understand. If you don't, well, whatever. I don't even care. Don't even. Okay. So, I think that's the rest of the food. But we do have chicken and steak, so we can go like this. At the same time, I can make these into hay bales, which I did in my last Let's Play, and I think it made sense, so we'll do it again right here. Boom. We'll go like that, and we'll have you there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, a like is greatly appreciated, as always. I'm going to finish this off-camera. I'm doing a lot of off-camera work on this world, so no biggie to do that. But... Comment down below for the question of the day. Also, would you like me to just keep using 1.7 or would you like me to use the 1.8 snapshots so I can get the new features that are coming around with that? It's completely your choice. I don't really care. It's just going to be repairing these. It's going to be very time consuming unless I make an enderman farm, which is going to be a while since I have to face the ender dragon. I don't even think I have any ender pearls, do I? That would be a good question. I don't believe... I do. I have a few, but... Not many, so hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video. Have a great day.